happy opening night. How do you feel right now? I feel good, relaxed, and uh, you know the the I guess the pressure's off now. So uh, we're getting just relaxed and have a good time this evening. And what was the crowd out there like tonight? Uh, it was a quiet audience, actually, a listening audience, uh, uh, one of the quieter audiences we've had. And but we, you know, we this was our 28th performance, I think, including previews. So we've had different kinds of audiences, and I think the actors pick up on it really quickly. Like, oh, okay, it's not going to be as much call and response as it's been some nights. So we just start hitting it and pick up the pace and keep it going. Yeah, tell me about that. The night I was there, the audience there was, was like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So you know, you you know what I'm talking about. You, yeah, you what do they do? Well, that's that's what theater is. It's alive. You know, it's it's not a movie, and you don't know where where people are coming from and what they're bringing to the theater. So that's a part of it. The, the, the last part of any play, great play or any play, is the audience, is the performance. Yeah, I would love to hear about how you kind of established the family dynamic with these guys. What have you guys been doing to kind of bond? Uh, we, we, well, we've been together for two, three months now straight, eight, 10, 12, 15 hours a day. Though That alone <laughs> will get will get it done. And I don't know if we did anything out of the ordinary, but we, we, we spent a lot of time together. Still now, when I listen to the play, where I, I get a chance to sit on stage in, in, in the bedroom and listen to the scene with Asagai and Benita, and that's the one time I really get to hear, we're well, early on in the play too, but on stage I get to hear Lorraine's words and her ideas and what she was talking about, and, and she's just a bright, shining star that left us too soon.